Here's a small little entertainment center from General Electric in 1985. It has a 5 inch diagonal TV screen. It has a TV selector, VHF or UHF. And we're going to be operating today at about channel 3, which is a little tricky to find on some of these old analog sets. And we have our scale for FM and AM radio. The whole unit is kind of a silvery grayish plastic, not unattractive. The carrying handle is recessed. This whole unit had the capability of being mounted under a cabinet. It came with a little bracket that slid in some grooves. And we have it off. We can turn on the radio by pushing that. We can turn on the television by pushing that. When you're on the television, you can select VHF or UHF. When you're on the radio, you can select FM or AM. Along the left side, you have controls, vertical hold, brightness, contrast, and an earphone jack. Along the right side, you have your television channel control, your radio control, and your volume control. You have what appears to be, uh, I don't know, four inch speaker. And here you can see one of the channels that the television would slide into. It repeats on the other side in the bracket that you would put under your cabinet. So this can be under cabinet mounted. Everything is flush no controls on the top or anything like that. Looking at the back, you can see a little bit more of our carrying handle at the top there. This is model 7-7150B. You can see we have some uh, ventilation grill work there. We have a 75 ohm jack for an external antenna. We will be using that today. We have our antenna we can pull out. Being under the counter, you're probably not going to do that, are you? But it can go other ways. We have a jack for a DC power source and AC. And we'll be using the AC power source today. We have some more ventilation ductwork around under there. Looking at the bottom of the unit, where the battery compartment is, you can see the person kept somewhat good history of their battery changes. The first one I see is February 86, May 86, March 91, I don't know, May 93, 1094, 596. But when I did open the battery compartment, it was filthy in there with exploded batteries, so eventually they gave up on their battery care. I did have to clean this when I got it because there was five of the nine D cells had exploded pretty badly. Um, as you can see, you can also use three battery sticks, each one equivalent to three D cells. The RCR 3D, I think it is. And here's our date code 1527. I don't know how well this will show up on the video, but there's actually a manufactured July 1985 mark there in very kind of faint ink. All right, to test the little television, I'm going to hook it up to a VCR. And I'm going to use a little uh, matching transformer. On the end of the matching transfer, I'm going to use another little matching transformer with the uh, 75 ohm plug. And a couple different connections here. I have found over time that it looks the best when I bridge these two connections rather than going that way or something. So we can plug that in. Start our show. 
This is the JVC HR S3600U. Came with the remote and things. So we'll try that out. Turn the monitor to TV. Turn that down. Probably going to get those uh, blanky lines there. Got our little guy ready to watch his show. He likes trees being cut down. Let's see. Mm, press play. The video doesn't look too bad since it's on an old VHS tape. I don't know how it'll look when I put it in the editor and upload it to YouTube. It's a little grainy, but it really isn't too bad. Let's fast forward a little. I don't know how good this will look at the end. Right now it looks a little grainy to me, but not much. It might accentuate that graininess though when I edit it or when I look at it in a bigger screen. But right now on this little five inch monitor or whatever it is, it really doesn't look too bad. Looks pretty good, to tell you the truth. Okay, well that shows a little bit how the monitor works. Let me uh, stop playback. Turn the TV off. All right, we've unhooked the television setup, so let's try the radio. You'll notice in this instance the uh, radio dial light scale lights up. I'm not sure I pointed that out. When it's on television, the television one does. And this just seems to be a red stripe. It doesn't turn on or turn off with the off button. Power is shown here or there. All right, let's start on AM. Northern Indianapolis, Carmel, Fishers, Zinesville, or Westfield. Give me a call and let me help show you the way home. 317 Most of my channels are on the high end of the band, of course. A little music today. Newest addition to the fan. Kevin Bowen, who covers the country. Whistling. Brought to you by Positive Coaching Alliance. Got issues with youth or high school? Right there, they saw. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
to make those adjustments on our shouting and, and go out there and compete and, and really establish you. And the little workbook, which is the best selling okay. of all the things and my Latino station at the top of the dial so that usually means uh, no more AM after that let's try FM Couldn't leave the antenna down only picking up high parts of the local anyway Bowen deserves wait a second ZTL, Indy's number one hit music station, Maroon 5 and Cardi B now. This is Girls Like You on ZPL. 24 hours on Something triumphant will come even out of our suffering. Great week here, folks. So great to be back with you after being absent. No matter, but you're going to have to wait on the porch. Better hide the world. People, listen. My cousins are crazy. My cousins are like bully. Life is amazing. It is what it should be. Been here for 10, but I feel like... Up on the bedroom floor. You should have hit it in the closet. Add Daylash on Twitter, official Daylash on Facebook. It's from Alec Bonier, the O.M. Well, I think we've worked our way through the radio stations as much as we could. This is actually a pretty good FM performer. I could easily keep it and use it for that if I wanted to. Don't know that I will. And anyway, that's been the 1985 General Electric 7-7150B. AM FM radio and 5-inch black and white television. AC, DC, battery operated, portable, under the cabinet mounting abilities. Thanks for watching. Bye.